everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name is Jenna. Today we're doing elephant toothbrush. <laughs> <laughs> elephant toothpaste. Elephant toothpaste. Yay! Yay! That's right, guys. Today we are making elephant toothpaste. Jenna, are you excited? Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. Are you ready to get started? Yeah. Let's get started! <laughs> Okay guys, so we have everything all set up. We have our water, we have our cylinders, flasks, whatever you want to call them. We have our yeast, yeast, a stirring spoon, food well, coloring, what is, what is dish this? soap, hydrogen peroxide. And guys, this hydrogen peroxide we just got from our local store, grocery store. And most videos that we've seen, most demonstrations that we've seen using hydrogen peroxide, they are usually at a higher percentage. Now this one is only at, I believe, 3%. So we don't know how out of control our elephant toothpaste is gonna get. So this is just an experiment using a very low percentage of the hydrogen peroxide with the yeast. So, Let's see. Hopefully we can get something exciting. Jenna, are you ready? Yes. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. So Jenna is all geared up and ready to go. She has on her goggles, her safety goggles, and she's going to go ahead and squirt a few drops of the dish soap into our, our um, container there. Go ahead, Jenna. Okay, I think that's, I think that's enough. And then she's gonna take the food coloring and squirt a few drops of food coloring into the container as well. Oh, okay. Okay, go ahead, Jenna. Great job. And then I am going to assist Jenna with the hydrogen peroxide. Uh, actually, so guys, this is about a hundred milliliters, so. All right guys, so that's about a hundred milliliters. Jenna, I need you to take the spoon or give it a little swish. Huh, go ahead, give it a little swish. Gently, we don't want to have any accidents. All right, you think it's good? I think it's good. Mm -hmm. All right, next guys, we're gonna mix up our yeast. We're gonna mix up our yeast and um, our warm water we have here. Okay, Jenna, go ahead and add just a little bit of water. Okay, that's enough. And go ahead and stir it up with your spoon. Okay. Okay. Oh, you gotta hold the cup. Uh-oh, it's okay. Let's see what it looks like in there. Ew. Let's stir it up a little bit more. Hold on to the cup, Jenna. We don't want to lose it. All right, while Jenna's stirring, we're going to go ahead and clean up our mess a little bit. Okay, guys, we're back, and Jenna's going to go ahead and add our yeast mixture to the container. Let's see what kind of reaction, if anything, we'll get. Go ahead, Jenna. Whoa! So exciting. I wouldn't touch it, Jenna. I don't know what it's gonna feel like. I did hear this is an exothermic reaction, which means it gets a little warm, but Jenna touched it anyway, and it's not that hot. It's not hot, guys. It, I mean, it's warm, but it's not hot, so. All right, Jenna, let's run sure. Thank you guys for watching. That was so cool. <laughs> All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, 
share and subscribe and we will see you in our next video jenna did you have fun yeah. that was so cool wasn't it yeah that was so cool guys maybe yeah. next time we can do the more stronger ingredients and get that super explosive reaction that would be but super but exciting but to I see straight. you want to do what Straight. Straight? Yeah. Oh, the one that goes straight up in the sky? Yeah. Yeah, that would be cool, wouldn't it? Well, like one? To We're gonna have to do that next time. We don't have the ingredients to okay guys. So next video, well maybe next video, but one of our next videos, we will do the one where the elephant toothpaste shoots straight up in the sky. Jenna wants to do that, so that would be super exciting to do. Alright, guys. Alright, bye. Bye, can I touch it now? My heart